WA researchers are trialling a new way to stop long-term paralysis from spinal injuries. It involves injecting patients with a freezing fluid to rapidly cool their body before long-term damage sets in. Craig Parsons has been confined to a wheelchair for the past 33 years after a motocross accident changed his life. It was my first uh, senior event and, and um, Southern Cross had slag heaps and I got hit at the top of the hill of one slag heap by a, another rider and then went over the handlebars, landed down the bottom about eight minutes below and then a couple of guys ran over us so I broke my neck. Three ambulance trips, an RFDS flight and nine hours later he finally received specialised treatment but the damage was irreversible. Craig's now a quadriplegic, completely paralysed below the shoulders. Unfortunately Craig's story is not a rare one. 80 people every year sustain a spinal injury in WA. That's twice the national average. Now WA researchers and paramedics are taking part in a groundbreaking trial which could help prevent spinal damage. We need to buy time by using hypothermia and cooling the patients. Uh, we will be aiming to do this en route to the hospital. Cooling the body slows the rate of cell damage, so as a patient is being rushed to hospital, paramedics will run a freezing cold saline drip through their bloodstream. We trial it with two litres of cold saline and you could cool the body down by up to about a degree to two degrees. This is really uh, quite exciting research and it may well mean, mean the difference between patients ultimately being confined to a wheelchair or being able to walk again. The state government funded trials will begin next year. Alicia Banner, 10 Eyewitness News.